still got the Mojave wheels on this one and the, the original body Hyper SF oh shit You know, what's going on, man? Can't seem to keep it on all four. Yeah, this one's got some power, man. The wheels in it. Mojave wheels. Control that a bit more, man. Drop shocks just come out. Yeah, I've got armor shocks on this because the uh, the stock half hour um, shock that the, the cap is plastic and it broke from the last bash. You know what I mean? So I put I put armor shocks on this side because the armor shock caps are uh, aluminium in it. You know what I mean? So, yeah, he's just come apart. He just, the shot just, just got to push it back in. Yeah. if it survived that man jeez fucking camera phone fell I doubt the car survived that man that tumble man oh To survive that man. Oh boy, that's tough.
That's a bad tumble. Did it survive? Oh my gosh. How about a tough? How about a tough, man? Jeez! How about a tough? I wonder if Arma could have survived that, man. Yeah. <coughs> I was saying, go be careful. Well, with me, when I jump, not to land on the front end. This is like a, the Arma Typhoon, isn't it? You know what I mean? The Arma Typhoon, I bashed it the other day. And the whole front shock tower is all bent up and twisted, you know what I mean? Uh, so, yeah, that's the thing about these buggies, man. You have to watch how you jump it. If it's a bad landing, you land on the front and on the shock tower and the, and the shocks and shit like that. You know what I mean? That's why I decided to fit different bodies, uh, especially on this car, this SSS, to, just to protect the shock tower and shit like that, man. You know what I mean? Because there's not really much protection. As you can see, the body's there. There's not much protection. So, yeah. Anyway, carry on, man. I think the battery's probably coming up to LiPo anyway. Where is it? Oh shit! Jeez! This thing's taking a hammer in, man. Yes, that was a better jump. Nice control jump there, man. Little backflip there. Right, this thing's still going, man. This is taking some hammering. It's taking a hammering. This thing's taking a hammering, man. How about a tough? Couple more jumps, call it a day, man. Oh, fuck. This is cold, 
again. Yeah, better stop soon before I break this, man. See, it's the front end. Not much protection. And the screw's broken on this. Yeah. Quite damage it more. Not broken, it's bent. Hang on. It's bent, you see? Where I put the armor shock, it's bent. The screw's bent in it, so... Yeah. Stop in a minute. I think we're coming up to life or anyway, man. Oh, that did it. Jeez. That did it, bruv. Jeez. <laughs> Fucking hell. These buggies, they fly, man. The Armour Typhoon, I've lost both body clips. No, the body clip is warped. The body clip is all battered. Um, don't know what the other one is. Yeah, call it a day, man. I've been running this long time. Yeah. Yeah, it's still... Uh, I think the dry shaft, the back called rear dry shaft, yeah, the dry shaft is buckled, man. Yeah, that's the easy fix. Just hammer the fucking thing, man. This car's taking a battering. It's taking a battering, man, this car. It's still going. It's still going, man. I wonder if the Typhoon would have survived that, man. I've run the Typhoon and jumped it and done all kinds of shit. And it's, as I said, with a typhoon, the, the, the shock tower is all uh, bent and warped, you know what I mean? And it's aftermarket shock tower as well, man. I've put on it. GPM. GPM shock towers. You know what I mean? So, yeah. Yeah, so... Leave it there with this one. Call it a day, man. Call it a day. I'm, I've been saying that. <laughs> I've been saying call it a day for the past five minutes, man. Jeez, and it's still carrying on. There was no one to quit. Yeah, call it a day, man. Fuck it. Yeah, it's still working. Just a bent up dry shaft, man. You see the dry shaft? It's all buckled. You know what I mean? And, uh, the screw is all bent where I put the armor shock shock in. Uh, that's about it, I think. Yeah. Turn this off. <laughs> 